We drink to our youth, to the days come and gone. For the age of oppression is now nearly done. We'll drive out the empire from this land that we own. With our blood and our steel, we will take back our home. Okay. Inigo, there you are. All what is on your mind? Okay. Okay. Um, okay. No, 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 come here. I drink things. and we sing. Let's go, okay? You lead, I follow. And when Southern Guard beckons, every one of us dies. Oh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay. Inigo, I just had the worst dream. I... Oh. Um... I'm okay, I think. I'm okay. I thought... I thought I was going to get stabbed in my sleep. I feel a, a bit silly. Panicking. But... I'm wondering why we are here. Uh, oh. As in... Yeah. Right. Okay. Do you want to go get something? Never mind. I'm... Okay. Just... Oh, just give me a moment, if you please. I'm... I'm not sure what just happened. I haven't really... woken up in a panic like that since... well... I, did I ever tell you about the Thalmor? I don't think I ever did. Well, I used to be a courier, you knew that, right? Um... It, there was a, a group of Thalmor ones that chased me up into the mountains. Not these mountains, the Gerald Mountains, back in Cyrodiil. And they nearly killed me, and that's how I met Mr. Red. The, uh, the Bosmer one, not the Brignolf one. And I have not woken up in a panic like that since... Since then, and since... Well... Since the clan got wiped out. So... I think I'll be okay. I'm not sure. I appreciate you just listening, though. Thank you. Okay. Uh, let me see if I can figure out what I'm supposed to be doing here, no? <laughs> no, I was supposed to check in with somebody somewhere, right? Okay, so let us go do that first, and then... I think... I think it is safer to go south to Falkreath rather than try to figure out what's going on with the kills at the moment. I would rather just get things to calm down a little bit there. Yeah, we won't go there. I don't need to make myself panic again. Uh, twice in a day is too many. And I know you don't like it here, so... Hold on, did we leave Frost somewhere? Uh, probably. You have that fancy horn, do you not? How are you doing, my friend? I'm not doing good, but thank you for your concern. If you want to... Summon Frost doing that thing that you do. I I will walk, you will ride, all will be well. Sounds like a plan. Okay. 
I want to see you do it. Oh! Right! I forget you don't have a horn, you just kind of... Frost. <laughs> that is most useful. I still think this is a trap, but at least I have a hatchet now. Oh! Somebody lost him? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Nope. We are steering very clear of that. Okay. She wishes to be a bit more cautious, no? Now, who exactly am I supposed to be speaking to and how far up the road is he? Probably not far. I'm gonna go up here. Figure that out. Ugh. Oh, he's probably at the farm. Or the mill. Yeah, that thing. Wrong turn. Oh, good grief. This one should get some potion ingredients or something and actually make some potions so that she can pose as a traveling potion salesman. Because that's a thing. Oh, this guy. Okay. Okay, here we go. Whatever you say. Ah. Uh, okay. You just It will be done. What can I do for you? Ah, uh, just Hold on one moment, please. If there's trouble, come get me. Will do. I very much will do. Pardon me? Strangers are always trouble. Uh-huh. And this one brings more trouble than normal, I think. You wanted to thank Zaytest for killing Enodius Papius? My joy knows no bounds. Here. A little payment for your troubles. I trust we'll never need to speak of this again to anyone. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, I can I can tell your joy in your voice, sir. Okay, that was <laughs> you are being sneaky. What is on your mind? I think in the bushes. <laughs> okay, time to go. Yes, let us go. Uh-huh. Alright. If you need anything else, just ask. Mm, not yet. Uh, now I just need to figure out the quickest way to Valkyrie, which would probably be... Uh, I don't know. But we'll get there. Start going this way and see where we can get to from here. This is my plan! And the Inigo is actually coming with me! You want to go grab Frost? You want to talk? Eh. Well. Okay, as you wish. Actually, I wanted you to go grab mm -hmm. Frost, but that's okay. Sounds like a plan. Oh, okay. <sighs> And Langley was concerned that I am a conjurer when he was not. Hello. That is kind of funny. Thank you, trees. We are grateful. Inigo always has something to say. Ooh, my crabs. Okay. Let's just get going, shall we? Well, It's cold. That tree is all bent over. <laughs> the smell of bandits here is making my steed uneasy. Uh-huh. Oh, trust me, it's making me uneasy as well. Thankfully, I do believe they are all dead bandits. Okay. <sighs> we should be good. Oh, 
boy. Oh boy. Ha 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 ha. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, 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 okay. Ah. We had such a nice pleasant ride over and now we have dragons. Oh, this does not go well. Okay. Let me get my armor on. Ah. Not that armor. That armor. Oh boy! I don't want to get my new fancy armor wrecked up by a dragon. No thanks. Oh gosh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh gosh. Ha 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 ha! Oh, that thing is huge. Where? Okay. This one knows that sometimes they just fly overhead, but she cannot help shooting at it anyway. Okay. And the spider. Well, she will shoot it at them. Maybe. Oh! Hi, Frost. Okay, that didn't yes, work. A spider. Mm -hmm. You wanna get him? I will let you get him. Especially because I do not like cold. Spiders. This one has two questions. Firstly, where did Inigo go? And se- oh. And there's the spider. So that answers both of my questions. Uh, one oh. less to worry about. <laughs> that was very satisfying splat there, Inigo. Okay. Oh, this one should probably wash out all of the uh, charcoal from her first so that Astrid does not think that I am somebody else. <laughs> I wonder what new excitements the rest of the day has planned for us. <laughs> Hopefully no more dragons, you know? That would not be... That would not be something that Zetas would like to deal with today. Twice. Twice even! Riding, riding, riding. My steed is a law abiding. Ride them down, pick them up, arrest the scum, have some fun, take a bribe, ruin the vibe. Law hide! <laughs> oh. Okay, 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 okay. That's a skirmish. And I am taking no part in this. This one is just washing her for a. Hold on a moment. Okay. I think that one is better. Uh, this one might still have a little bit stuck on her fur, but uh, at least the skirmish has moved on now. And we can get back to it. Okay. Oh. Hello. Mm. That's a lot of dead bodies. This one is not like. Okay, we're going. See something going on over here. What is going on? Is it just a hunter being a hunter? Ah, this one's going to so so. Do not shoot! Uh. Oh! What the ha! What? Get out of here, Steed. We have trouble. We have something for sure. What are you wearing? That is one ugly helmet. Oh. Ah. 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 You cannot hit me. Easy. No mercy from Kajit. Are you okay? <laughs> hmm. That's a weird looking helmet. Oh. Okay, let's go. Peggy wishes to get out of here very, very quickly. Oh, look! Frost has a twin.
<laughs> She's tired of almost being cut down, please. Please stop. Hello, Mr. Fox. Maik? Is that you? Why is that? <laughs> Maik is having a good time, it seems. I would recognize that face anywhere. To be so tired. Nature has claimed this place. <laughs> yes, it has. Okay. Uh, You're the boss. Eh, thank you. Eh, uh, I'm. What is on your mind? Uh, I need just a moment. I will be right back. I will be here. Okay. <laughs> I am very tired. Nature has indeed reclaimed this place. Although I don't think it was ever unclaimed to by by nature to begin with, so. Oh boy. Inigo, wait there. Inigo, do this. Inigo, kill that. Inigo, wait some more. Sometimes I wish I was not so agreeable. <laughs> Inigo is a fun person. The amulet, a priest, and Delvin says all of the things about the, the exactly what you expected. Um, the letter of credit, all that. <laughs> the news is everywhere. Vittoria Vici, the Emperor's cousin, butchered at her own wedding. Well done. What? Let's see his eminence try to ignore this. Mm -hmm. Uh, yes, this is very, very good news, no? With Vici's murder, you've started us down a path the Dark Brotherhood hasn't traveled in centuries. The assassination of an emperor. And now your reward. A unique spell to summon a legend of the Dark Brotherhood. His soul serves us now in death as his body once did in life. Okay. Ah, and of course, a bonus for killing Vici while she addressed her guests as instructed. Gold. Simple and pure. Spend it as you will. Now then, time to proceed to the next stage of the plan. Go and speak with Gabriella. She's been helping me arrange your next contract. I see. Um, thank you very much, Miss Astrid. Uh, yes, 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 this was... Uh, it was all part of the plan. Yes. Oh, who killed Victoria? I feel very bad taking advantage of whoever did that, because this one definitely did not. What is going on? This one is confused. Very, very, very confused. Where's the lizard? Is the question. Too old, too feeble. Oh. There is more knowledge in me than in two of you pups put together. And knowledge. Knowledge is my weapon. You know, she's older than she looks. Like, a lot older than she looks. Anyway. Hello, Nazir. I, I still have a bunch of contracts I'm trying to do for you, but... Speaking of contracts, this one has heard that you have something for me, Miss Gabriella. Dear sister, I've been waiting for you. Your next contract awaits, as I'm sure Astrid indicated. Mm-hmm. What are the details? With the Emperor's arrival in Skyrim now a certainty, his security service, the Penitus Oculatus, will need to begin its preparations immediately. Security is being handled by a Commander Morrow. Astrid and I have devised a plan to break the man, and in doing so, cripple the Emperor's protection. Your you are to slay the Commander's son, Gaius Morrow, 
And once he is dead, plant false evidence on his body, implicating him in a plot to kill the Emperor. Mm. Okay, uh, the testing she understands, and she will do this very thing. He is set to leave the Penitus Oculatus outpost at Dragonbridge and inspect the security of each city in Skyrim. Go there now. Observe Gaius Moro's departure and follow him. Waylay him in one of the cities and send his soul to Sippus. Once he's dead, plant the incriminating letter on his body and let fate take care of the rest. Oh, and one final thing. Yes. To earn your bonus, do not kill Gaius Moro in Dragonbridge or on the road. Kill him in one of the other major cities he'll be visiting. There, the body will be discovered quickly, as will the letter implicating Gaius Moro in the plot to assassinate the Emperor. Do that, and Astrid has authorized me to grant you a rather unique bonus. It is a special token to be given to Olava the Feeble in Whiterun. Olava is an old and dear friend, and a powerful seer. The token entitles you to a reading of your future. It's an opportunity one should not pass up. Okay. Uh, this one does not know how she feels about fortune tellers. tellers. Your latest Easy for me to say. Has the but, uh... Word certainly travels fast, uh, good grief. The part uh, what the precisely will killing Gaius Maru accomplish? What is... My compliments. This one has when not I been filled in as to all of the plans regarding then, how we're going to then, do this assassination. We have trying, no but she's trying to catch up. What can you tell me about this thing? Killing Commander Morrow would do no good. Someone would merely replace him. Oh. No, we need him to remain in charge, but distracted, weakened. Implicate and kill his son Gaius, and the commander will be grief-stricken and humiliated, his family name ruined. The security plan will then fail. Best yet, the Emperor will be lulled into a false sense of security, thinking an assassination plot had already been discovered and foiled. Oh, this makes sense. Yes, 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 yes. And, uh, do you know Gaius Morrow's schedule, perhaps? No, so your best plan is to follow him after he leaves Dragonbridge. However, there is one other option. Oh? We know there's an actual written travel schedule somewhere in the Penitus Arculatus outpost. Securing that would obviously be most beneficial. I heard about okay, this sounds like a job for a test. Actually, it does not sound like a job for a test, but she will do it. Walk in Gaius Morrow's shadow and deliver to him the judgment of Sithis. Mm -hmm. Impressive! You earned your bonus on that one. <sighs> you give me too much credit. Oh, For how could I fail? I am, after all, just a little girl. Gaius Morrow what still lives. I'm oh, surprised. Just I assumed you were more <laughs> competent. Oh. He expects too much of this one. <laughs> Holy crap. That thing is so creepy. So creepy. This one is way to kill him tomorrow. <laughs> Here today, gone tomorrow. Anyway, this one is full of bad jokes. Oh, need to go. Is he mumbling to himself again? Yep. Okay, new plan. Waiting is boring. Shall we go? Yes, indeed. We're off to Dragon Bridge. Yes, let us go. It's going to be a long haul. I hope you're in for it. Oh, we're probably gonna have to go up this way and then that way. And then all over the place because this one does not really want to try going up through that place with the werewolves again. Even if it has been cleared out cleared out. She worries that there may be another pack lingering there now that the territory has opened up. That's how bandits work. I don't know if it's how 
Uh, werewolves work. Yeah. Cool, I have to cook in tomorrow. Oh, uh. Oh, oh you left Frost. You left Frost. It, it, we did it in a go. You want to talk? Yeah, go grab Frost, please. Actually, before you do that. Okay, then. Apparently, somebody killed Victoria Vici. This one does not know who it was, but there is only one person. Well. Mm. Unless Ulfric Stormcloak has some very, very talented individual on his team. This one thinks Ingrat may be up to something. And she does not know what. And she feared for his health. Yes, my friend. Mm -hmm. Okay, now you can go get Frost. Sounds like a plan. Poof! <laughs> it's so cool. Oh, here we go. We zoom. Zoom, 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 zoom. Are you kidding me, another dragon? Oh boy. Eh, eh, where? Uh, it's right above my head. Yep, there it is. Oh, you can see the shadow. That's kind of cool. Hey, uh, here we go. You should. I, what is on your mind? Okay, fair enough. I know this was probably going to uh, fly off, but just in case it does not. Hello there, Mr. Dragon. Oh, grief, it's gorgeous and terrifying at the same time. No? I think we're good. Something on your mind? <laughs> yeah, a dragon. Okay. Let's uh let's get out. Okay. Or head out, rather. Ooh. Yikes. Where's the dragonborn when you need her? Time to end this uh, game. Every single time. Oh, this one's not as good a shot as England, that's for sure. Make a fine rock, cat. I can Which one of us are you talking to exactly? Oh, hello! Thank you, mister. Oh, this one does not know who that is. This is a surprise. You handle them? Me into a rug, yes? I'll be wiping my feet on your clothes. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I picked the wrong one. I'll take this one. You picked a bad one, friend. I am not your friend, mister. Oh, okay. <sighs> well, this one knows many ways to take care of mages. <laughs> I'm not prepared. Sorry! Okay, let's do it. Are you okay? Again. You are not. I'm you sorry. I'm going to have to hurt you. Who? Oh, there's one behind us. This is. Hit me again if you can. This is very awkward. <laughs> that will leave a bruise. Oh wait! I think that maybe we should surrender. Lucky. Nope! No surrendering here. We just needed to Are you okay? That looked like it hurt. You are injured. Maybe you should get your strength back before we continue. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, let us get back I to I could it. not tell. The other adrenaline was a little bit. <laughs> oh, I can feel it now though. Huh, better. I hope my faithful steed wants to go where I want to go. I agree with this. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that looks fake to me. I found a fake. A very good. Oh. You know, Frost doesn't really fit through that door. Could you could you back up maybe a little bit? Eek. Whatever 
do you say? Thank you, Nico. Frost, please. Please, Frost. Thank it you. will be done. Okay. The smell of bandits here is making my steed uneasy. Yeah, no kidding. I'm sorry, sir. That was most unfortunate. Why is there always somebody camped out here? It's not like this is an especially hidden place. Uh, I need my eyes. There we go. Ugh, this one really did get injured, did she not? Oof. Are you finished ogling the grotesque? I'm not ogling the grotesque. My eyes are just big because I'm seeing in the dark. Ugh, Nords. This one does not understand Nords. And she used to work with one, even. His name was Einar. He was... the. He was kind of the leader before... Well... Cow. Handy giant. We are going to steer around these end. Hello! How are you? A fine night for a walk. Holy crap, that guy could crush the shit with... Merely a footstep. As she was saying... Yes, his name was Einar. And then his last name was like Bjornsson or something. Some Nord name. Son of... Blah, 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 whoever. And he left. This one was never really sure why. He just kind of... This was before the collapse that I was kind of not telling you about. He just left. And... I mean, it was kind of hard on all of us, but... Because he was our leader, but we knew that Ingra would take over if... if or Cayman would take over if... Um, happened. But it turns out I really didn't tell Cayman that he was taking off either. And he did not take that well. That was very hard to watch. <sighs> Ingrath took off after that too. He went off for a while and... Good idea! He came back eventually. But... Anyway, I have a thing what to do. What is on your mind? Uh, you wait here. I will be back. Whistle if you need me, okay? Will do. Also, be careful and all of that. Ugh, this one cannot stand moving so slowly, but she cannot move any faster because she is... this <laughs> oh oh boy father you worry too much I'll be fine I know you will but all the same remember everything I said stay alert get to the cities make your observations I understand you're being paranoid Inspecting security, not charging off into battle. There's not a lot that can go wrong. Son, when the Emperor's safety is concerned, anything could go wrong. Off with you now, and good travels. Farewell, Father. I'll return as soon as I'm able. Well, this is it then. Look after yourself, guys. You're doing your okay, duty. So Commander you, but then. you better come back to me. You hear? Oh, Fida. I may travel alone. But you know I carry you always in my heart. So soon. Careful here. Do not move. Okay. 
That was equal. Okay. It looks like this one's going to have to wait until he goes to bed. Or something. So she will just linger around out here. And hopefully... Not get... Ooh, this is not a good place to be. Good job, Zaytest. Hopefully not get caught. Oh boy. First, let's munch something so that my stomach doesn't get me away. Hopefully, we have timed this just right. Okay. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, okay, okay. In you go. Ready? I have indeed. Sorry it took so long. I'm right behind you. Okay. First I need to know this Tordas. I need to know what day it was. Uh Okay, so if it's last today, we just head to White Run. We may be able to catch him in Markarth tomorrow. Heh, <laughs> tomorrow. However, repeat until I have recalled you personally. And make note of any irregularities. This could be interesting. Hmm. Well... Uh, this one does not... Hmm, this one does not like the idea... ...of waiting for a very long time for him in Riften. But since she has other business there, perhaps that is the best course of action. Hmm. Alright, here's the plan. Well, kind of. My plan is we stop in White Run overnight. If I see him there, we will take care of that there. And if not, then. We ride for Riften and wait for him there. While I deal with uh, stuff. This should be fun, no? Huh? 
Ugh. Ah, Riften makes these one's eyes hurt a little bit. Uh, oh. Her side. Oh! You wearing your blue armor. Nice. Okay. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right oh. place. Pull up a seat. That is me. Okay. In the go? Yes, my friend. Uh, I will be back. I am all ears. Mm hmm. I feel very, very bad going into this alone. But I'm going to do it anyway. You want to relax here while I go do my things? Okay, come and get me when it is time to go. Okay. Oh, this is not going to go well. <coughs> Ooh, somebody sounds like they are not having a good time. Uh, and no sign of Mr. M. The Did fairest prices and the highest quality in Skyrim. I live to tell about it. Jewelry with legendary Argonian craftsmanship. I've come to warn you that the Thieves Guild seems to be back to its old tricks again. Did something happen at the Pawn Prawn? Oh, one of them came in and demanded payment. Looking Fair to stay alive? To tell them no. Why take a chance? Stood up to them, but... Just when you think things couldn't get any worse. Need something? Nope. Beautiful baubles and gleaming Her gemstones. Here. Okay. Oh boy. Good day, Grelka. What's so good about it? Hm? I've got deadbeats who don't pay me, the city guard looking over my shoulder, and Maven Blackbriar breathing down Rare my neck. Rare trinkets and the finest oddities from Moral. Boy, howdy. Heh <laughs> an ingratism. Alrighty. Let us try out this new armor, no? It is very, very snazzy. This one does not think that they will notice her very easily. With this on. Well, maybe. I don't know. It is much easier to sneak in than... Well, pretty much anything else, and especially not a dress. Okay. I'm glad you're here. I think some of these people are beginning to suspect who I am. Hmm. Are you ready to face the guild? Uh, no. What if Mercer's in there? Then we show them Gallus's journal and hope for the best. Oh gosh. Remember, we have proof and all he's got is his word. Uh, this is true. But... Gosh, it knows how people are and she's not sure that they will even trust proof if they're too set in their ways. Any advice? Keep your eyes open. I'm not sure what to expect when we enter the system. Okay. This one will keep her axe on her. Don't worry, I'm just making sure that everything is all good. <laughs> Kajit must be nervous, she's got her speedy feedback. I don't know who I am, right? Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh no. 
better have a damn good reason to be here without oh. murderer. Oh boy, please. Uh, Brim? Lower your weapons so we can speak. I have proof that you've all been misled. No tricks, Carlia, or I'll cut you down where you stand. Now what's this so-called proof you speak of? I have Gallus's journal. I think you'll find its contents disturbing. Let me see. No, it can't be. This can't be true. I've known Mercer too long. It's true, Brynjolf. Every word. Mercer's been stealing from the guild for years, right under your noses. There's only one way to find out if what the last says is true. Delvin, I'll need you to open the vault. Wait just a blessed moment, Bryn. What's in that book? What did it say? It says Mercer's been stealing from our vault for years. Gallus was looking into it before he was murdered. How can Mercer open up a vault that needs two keys? It's impossible. Could he pick his way in? That door has the best puzzle locks money can buy. There's no way it can be picked open. You didn't need to pick the lock. What's she on about? Use your key on the vault, Delvin. We'll open it up and find out the truth. I've used my key, but the vault's still locked up tighter than a drum. Now use yours. I hope you know what you're doing, Carlyle. Right, the eight. It's gone. Everything's gone. Get in what? here, all of you. Oh. Oh, holy crap. The gold. It's yours. It's all gone. That son of a bitch. He don't I'll kill him. Vex, put it away. Right now. We can't afford to lose our heads. We need to calm down and uh -huh. focus. Do what he says, Vex. This ain't helping right now. Fine. We do it your way. For now. Delvin, Vex, watch the flagon. If you see Mercer, come tell me right away. <sighs> Sorry, this did not this she did not mean to squeak that loudly, but uh Where was he going with it all? How did he get out of... Mitsu does not want to know. She really does not. <laughs> okay. Uh... There's a lot of angry thieves in here right now. Mr. Brynjolf? Look, before I help you track Mercer down, I need to know what you learned from Carlia. I mean, everything. Oh, uh, you look. <laughs> Never mind. You look angry enough to like. Anyway. So, in order of the things that I learned that them in, Tashi the scared. Can you tell? Carlia was behind Golden Glow and Hunting Brew. Trying to make Mercer look bad in front of Maven, eh? Clever lass. Mm -hmm. Was there anything else? Oh, you betcha. Mercer killed Gallus, not Carlia, And he almost killed me, too. Aye. I feared that was the case. From that last entry in Gallus's diary, it looks like he was getting close to exposing Mercer to the guild. Anything else? Gallus, Carlia, and Mercer were nightingales, whatever that means. What? Nightingales? But I always assumed they were just a tale. A way to keep the young footpaths in line. Was there anything else she told you? Mm. Nope, I think that's it. Then I have an important task for you. I need you to break into Mercer's home. And search for anything that could tell us where he's gone. He has a house in Riften? Really? Aye. A gift from the Black Briars after they kicked the previous family out. Place called Rift Wheeled Manor. He never stays there, just pays for the upkeep on it. Hired some lout by the name of Bold to guard the place. Okay. Harit will take care of it. Be careful, lass. This is the last place in Skyrim I'd ever want to send you. Just find a way in, get the information, and leave. And you have permission to kill anyone that stands in your way. Oh. Zeta likes his permission. Because she finds uh, a lot of people in, in her. <laughs> Sorry, I just. 
you know, early dying hurts. What's the best way to get into the manor? Good question. I've only set foot inside a few times myself, and that was in Mercer's company. If you can get past his trained watchdog, I think your best bet might be the ramp to the second floor balcony in his backyard. Is the ramp easy to get to? No. It's some sort of crazy contraption Mercer commissioned for quick escapes. I'd wager a well-placed shot at the ramp's mechanism would lower it in a hurry. Okay. You're grinning. <laughs> this bothers me. Okay. Hmm... Think first. Uh, you mentioned a watchdog, no? <laughs> That'd be bald. A real piece of work, that one. Okay. Mercer's holding something over his head, keeping him loyal. Talk to Vex. She used to know him very well, if you catch my meaning. Oh boy. Lucky guy, I think. Maybe not. I don't know. It looks like there was a lot missing from in there. But... What precisely am I looking for? Better question would be, what did he leave? Mercer took everything. Even all of our plans are gone. Plans for what? Before Mercer took over, Gala started collecting every bit of material he could on locations the guild could heist. Museums, keeps, estates, you name it. By the time Mercer took over the guild, we must have had a few dozen. How could he have opened the vault door alone? This is what is on the... How? I don't have a clue. That door is impenetrable. Mm -hmm. Without two keys, it's impossible to open. I have a key, Delvin has a key, and Mercer has a key. That's it. There are no other copies. And neither you nor Delvin were opening the vault for him. Hmm. Okay. This one will find out what she can and get back to you. Careful at Mercer's place. I don't want to lose anyone else to that madman. Yeah, no kidding. Well, you almost did. This one will be very, very careful. I am probably the best person to send on that particular mission, actually. <laughs> How are you holding up? I'm relieved Brynjolf has an open mind, or that could have gotten bloody. Yeah, no kidding. Okay. This one's going to sit and have a drink for a little while, figure out what she can, and... And then figure out what she can some more. <laughs>